President Chambi drove to Indola Airport for ceasefire discussions with the United Nations. But fate intervened as the aircraft carrying Mr. Dag Hammarskjöld, Secretary General of the United Nations, crashed into the bush seven and a half miles north of Indola. At this juncture, the eminent person assesses it to remain plausible that an external attack or threat was a cause of the crash. The eminent person notes that the alternative hypotheses that appear to remain available are that the crash resulted from sabotage or unintentional human error. The Secretary General notes that the eminent person considers that it is almost certain that specific, crucial, and to date undisclosed information exists in the archives of member states. The Secretary General further notes the eminent person's assessment that he has not received, to date, the specific responses to his specific queries from certain member states. With significant progress having been made, the Secretary General calls on all of us to renew our resolve and commitment to pursue the full truth of what happened on that fateful night in 1961. This great organization grew out of the pain and turmoil of the last war. It welded together in what should be a continued cooperation for world peace, all those who had fought against oppression. By all who have sacrificed themselves, <coughs> by all sacrificing themselves in the fight for freedom and peace, <coughs> 